Hi, my name's Lawrence and I bought a fire engine off of eBay, which I have restored and I use on a daily basis. So I bought it off eBay and it was £1,500. It was the, the, the only thing on the listing was a case of, it was a non-runner, it was completely not dead, it was sold as seed, so it was a proper gamble. I wasn't actually uh, looking for a fire engine all the while. I look every so often for weird and wonderful vehicles on, on eBay just because it's nice to actually have something a bit different for than, uh, than some other things. I mean, I'd, I'd love a DeLorean and things like that. So uh, when I did see it, uh, the price was reasonable, I thought, for such a big piece of equipment. So I thought, you know what, let's just, just go for it. So, so, so the wife, she, uh, it's come to the point now where it's pointless asking her because if whatever answer she gives, I'll just go and do it anyway. So uh, if she said no, I'll still go and buy something or do something outrageous. So it's a case of she'll just let me get on with it. You know, so. The perks of having a fire engine, then it, it, it most likely got to be the driving around and people just giving way. They'll let you out of the junctions. Uh, I've had somebody stop on an island to let me come onto the island, which was just absolutely outrageous for, for them. It was just silly, but uh, it was great for me. And the, only, the only downside of owning the fire engine I've noticed so far is, uh, is the fuel cost. Uh, it's just absolutely outrageous uh, because it uses between four and eight miles to the gallon. So it's just, it's, it's terrible, the cost of actually running one. But, I don't think that outweighs the, uh, the positives of both in one. It's a, it's a, it's a fire engine. Who, who doesn't want to have a vehicle that is, is more entertaining, in my eyes, than a Ferrari or a Lamborghini? But everybody, even the firefighters, have been mistakenly realised, well, mistaken me for a real fire engine, uh, which it's nice, I mean it's nice I mean, when, the, when the police drive past they give us a nice big wave, we've had the ambulances going past, uh, papping their horns and having a good wave and, and, and other fire engines having a wave, so it is, nice, uh, it is nice to be part of that little community that they've got going on there. <laughs> but, uh, but no, it, with, with the fire engine I've never had to pull over yet or, or help anybody out or anything like that. Uh, when this was brand new in 1997 uh, it would have actually cost around £150,000. And then fully kitted out with all the uh, fire equipment that they need. It would have been uh, close to a quarter of a million pound vehicle. Been shopping in it quite a few times. Uh, parking, it, yeah, there's plenty of bays to have a, have a good go. It's just hard, harder to do it on a Saturday when, when there's a lot more vehicles. So, so far, we've been, I've been having some fun. I've been trying to be a bit more adventurous with it and do things that I'll probably never be able to do ever. I'm never going to sell it, to be honest. I'm never going to sell it, but uh, I would accept sensible offers.